Hey, have you ever heard of Hometown Beard and Body? If you haven't, you might want to stay around and watch this video. And if you have, you might find some sense here. I'm going to talk about pretty interesting. But I've actually, actually done a review for it in the past. Now I'll link that video at the end of this video. But today we're going to talk about four different scents I've got from my Hometown Beard and Body. But first, let's go on the website real quick. So I just do want to show you some things real quick before I talk about the scents. And just let you know, he does have his shop on Etsy. Now he does have different combos, like old butter combo. A pour, he has a poured butter and a whipped butter as well. And there's different prices, but we're gonna actually gonna talk about the, just the oils, cause I'm just gonna talk about the oils real quick. So he has a, the one ounce oils for $15. If you click on that, there's a drop down menu and you can pick the scent you want. And what I do like about this, uh, with, uh, his page is that he has all the scents listed right here. So if you click on the more button right above the pictures, you can actually see a list of all his different scents in one place. So that is cool to see. Now I got four different scents here in front of me. So we're going to pick up one and then talk about it. So the first one I'm getting here is cool fruit. So if we go on here and look at the listing here, cool fruit takes you back to childhood summer drinks of apricot peaches, pomegranate, mango, pineapple, lime, mandarin, oranges, lemons. It says cool off with a splash of fruit. So actually what I get out of this is definitely a nice fruity scent. It, it smells just like Kool-Aid. Very, very nice scent. Oh yeah, it just it smells it smells like a really fl fruity drink. It smells just like a, a Kool Aid. Just brings back the cool childhood memories. It's really a really awesome scent there. It's just mm. yeah, yeah. Oh, just awesome scent, awesome scent, y'all. It's if you like if you like to smell Kool Aid, you're you're gonna love this one here. So let's go back to the website, and the next one I'm gonna pick up is called Blue Nile. Now Blue Nile is right here. It says where gardenia and lotus blossoms float on musk, sandalwood, amber tones and notes. This one uh, you will need to uh, smell to believe. So let's take a little smell of this one here real quick. Now this one's going to smell pretty good too. I actually, all four scents I've already obviously already smelled and. They all smell really great to me, so. Oh, yeah, it's really, really nice and fresh. Get that, that flowery. Get that, you know, get that flowery note from that blossom. You get, get, get got kind of a, that amberness in there, too. So, but of course, you get a, uh, the sandalwood kind of gets a kind of, I think the sandalwood in there kind of dials down the, the blossom note, though overall it's just a really really nice scent so i want to say you know with that musk in there it's kind of bone s too so it's really really cool scent awesome scent so really something really really awesome as well and the next one i'm gonna get let's go back to the web page is grandma's kitchen grandma's kitchen so let's find grandma's kitchen here right down here at the bottom it says Head back to places where you can't visit only in memories. Grandma's uh, kitchen indulge in apple pie with undertones of grandpa's pipe tobacco. Welcome back home. All right. So got apple tones and grandpa's pipe. So I always like the one because in bottle, you know, you, you're, you're going to pick up some notes, but you really can't really sense the, the total smell of it until you have to get out of the bottle and warm it up. That's when all the notes are going to start blossoming out. So that's a really, that's a, actually smells like kind of like apple pie. Then you kind of get those back notes of some tobacco in there. So it's a really, it's a really simple blend. You got apple pie. And some tobacco in there, so it's a really, really cool scent. Just kind of mixed together. It's a really unique scent, so it's pretty awesome. But I, I mostly get that apple pie with some undertones at the tobacco. It's really, 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 really cool scent. All right, back to the website real quick. 
Now, last one is, I have here is called Vanilla Spice. So let's find out Vanilla Spice. It's just a little further up. It says, we'll smooth your soul with a soft vanilla and sexy mix of cinnamon and clove. All right. So let's shake those up. And always, you know, when the bottle's sitting around for a little bit, always shake it up. Get those juices mixed in, in, in there. All right, so that, uh, when I first get, I first get that vanilla. Then you start getting a little bit of cinnamon and clove in there. So, oh yes, so I you have to the definitely good set for the, I mean, good name for this vanilla spice. Cause that, that at first you get that vanilla in there. And then you, like I said, you get, then you start picking up that cinnamon and clove starts coming through. Yeah, that's a really, really cool scent. So actually, all these four scents are really cool. Now, just let me show you the, the bottles real quick. So here is his labeling. He's kind of handwritten the the, uh, the name of the scent. So this one is Cool Fruit. So this is what his uh, bottles look like. Comes in the black black bottle with the dropper top. So remember again, it is one ounce for $15. So I will have a link to his Etsy shop in the description below. So once again, uh, if you haven't checked out my review video for it, it will be just linked up here in just a second and go check it out if you haven't seen it already. And remember, keep, keep your beers and stashes healthy, healthy. till the next, next video. video.